Good morning, guys. I am up, obviously. Uh, some of the things I say. I have decided that I wanna clear this table out. Um, yes, we are keeping the other half of her stuff up in the room across from hers, but I don't wanna move all this up there to just kind of bring it back down. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna move it to my room. I wanna move it for two reasons. The first one being, I just don't want it to look this cluttered. And the second one being that, um, I don't know, I'm just kind of looking at it all the time and it's just a reminder that she's going. Um, even though where I'm moving it to, I'm gonna see it every day anyway. I'm gonna move it to my room. I don't wanna move it to my craft room because, um, because I don't, I don't have the space in there either. So we're gonna move it to my room. As you can see, I got it all cleaned out, but yeah, just in part of that second reason of not just kind of seeing it every day. And of course I'm gonna see it every day because it's in my room, but I think it also helps with my daughter not seeing every day. She doesn't come into my room all that often. So um, yeah, just, just in case anything like that just makes her nervous, you know, because she's gonna be a freshman and so it's just gonna be really different and yeah so all right we got it all cleared out and now I'm gonna make her breakfast but I'm gonna make that off camera so I thought I'd share it with you I still oh lord I still have not gotten the full-length mirror that I want so that I can do like a whole try on video for you guys but because it's just i love watching clothing hauls and clothing videos and i love to see the try on i mean to not see the try on i just feel like why are you showing this but um i got this gorgeous piece i love it so much i had really high hopes for this i was hoping that it was going to be like a longer, bigger fit because sometimes she and clothes can come up a little short on my torso. And I don't feel like I really have an extra long torso or a short, I feel like I just have maybe somewhere in between. Um, so sometimes their stuff can come up short, even though it's not labeled like as a crop top. Here is this next one. It is just a long cardigan and it's beautiful. It has like these really fun flecks of color in them and just from far away it kind of looks very fall and i love it i love that it has pockets because i usually wear stuff like this around the house and i'll slip in my phone sometimes even a remote the one thing i will say is the pockets are angled differently so there's that now this is a somewhat of a crop top and i knew i knew i wanted it like this i was actually specifically searching um, just because I'm trying to figure out, you know, all the different ways that I want my style to look like for fall. And I kind of envision myself wearing like a white shirt, just some kind of layers and maybe other 
undershirts. So I'm not gonna actually wear this like a crop top on my body, meaning nothing else to extend the top out. I'm not wearing it like that. I'm actually just using it as a layering mechanism. So I am gonna have longer t-shirts or something underneath. And um, I think this would even look cute with just like yoga pants or leggings or something. Um, and some black Nikes and I, I don't know, I, I feel like that would look cute casual and then I could do the same look on top with like jeans and, and maybe uh, leopard mules or not mules, but you know, like leopard flats or something like that. I think that would look cute. Um, this top right here is brand new. I've never seen Shein put out and I was so excited when I saw it. It is a block colored type. This is the back. I believe yeah and this is the front and you can see and it's just I love how chunky and huge the sleeves are I will say putting this up against my body it's not too bad I think I got a size medium and hopefully I think it's gonna fit like a true medium maybe slightly shorter than I would want it but overall I haven't tried it on I'm just holding it up to see what I think. I just love all the different color blocking that they've done here and I love the turtleneck thing. It's making me very, very excited. And maybe that's what we'll do today. So I'll go get a mirror. Here is this sweater. I've been eyeing this sweater from Shein for about a year and a half, maybe longer. So this is an item that they've had for a while. And the very first time I actually saw it was on Pinterest. And then when I clicked on it, it took me to Shein. I was like, oh my gosh. And that was, I think, actually how I discovered Shein in the first place. Um, not off of this specific sweater because I've been doing Shein for like four or five, four-ish years. But I just found something really cute on Pinterest and it was on a website like that. Anyway, I've been eyeing this sweater and it is gorgeous. I love the color combination. It's not too rainbowy, but you get that effect, but the colors are, um, I love the color combination. It's just very 70s for me. Um, it is, I think, I think it falls a little short. You guys can't see, I'm also in my robe, but um, I'm thinking this is gonna fit really nicely. And I'm not sure that this was a one size fits all. I think I ordered a medium I'm not entirely sure but there we go I'm seriously distracted by my face so without further ado let me go fix myself up and we will um, we'll take a trip to go get a mirror all right I am done getting ready so I'll just kind of show you what I decided I am wearing just some yoga pants decided to wear my girls today this is actually probably one of my favorite gifts i've ever received of all time my daughter gave it to me for christmas a couple years ago and i think she got it at old navy um at the time but it's just one of my favorites one because it's white and i love white t-shirts with black leggings and two because it's the squad um i'm wearing these nike shoes which i got on ebay and I'm wearing my Nike hat. I decided to put my hair up in a braid and I'm not gonna wear makeup today, but I am wearing makeup. I'm just wearing powder and I concealed this a little bit just because it was a breakout. Um, and it was just really distracting. And then what else, the other thing I did was I added some earrings and I added some bracelets, which I normally don't ever do. Not normally, I've never done this before. I've never worn jewelry when I'm wearing just kind of athletic wear. Um, but I really like the look. I've kind of seen it on Instagram and stuff, and I thought I'd give it a try. And I actually really do like it. I feel like it makes me feel like I'm wearing a cute outfit, but also being casual and also having like that feminine touch because usually when I'm wearing workout stuff, I don't wear a shirt like this. I complete the whole outfit with like a workout top and I don't ever wear jewelry like this. So this is my outfit. I really, really love it. And I'm just, I've been really getting into 
fo I've been putting more effort into um, what I wear day in day out. Today is more of a casual day, but I still did something kind of new and I really like it. All right, um, the rest of my room is in shambles. Um, now that I have this in here, which is um, some of my daughter's dorm stuff, the rest of it again is upstairs, my bed isn't made. This is what I was wearing a minute ago, but I actually now need to clean it because I cooked breakfast and I got grease and stuff on it. And these are clothes that came out of the dryer that needs to be put up and new clothes that needs to be put up and bed needs to be made. But honestly, today's one of those days where I, I don't want to do any sort of cleaning. I, I want to not give a crap about any of it. Here is Loxy. Um, but as much as I don't want to give a crap, I at least want the kitchen to be done because I feel like if any room in the house needs to be nice and clean, it should be the kitchen and bathrooms. So I'm going to go ahead and get the camera set up and you and I can do some cleaning up in there. And I'm just, honestly, these videos give me my own motivation. So if this motivates any of you, um, that I'm really, I'm really happy and glad that it, if it can do that for you. to bypass the mirror for today and I'm at Michael's getting some planner stuff um, watching Bianca and she was doing like these happy notes and I've never even seen these before because I haven't been looking at planner stuff in a while and really interesting these little note things so I got this one and then I'm gonna get two sticker pads the journaling one and then the happy year one I almost got the super mom one but there are some that just I think it's like for a mom that still has a kid in the house because it says things like practice and and my daughter's going to college so I didn't think that would work for me um, everything is on 30% off sale but I'm also trying not to spend too much so and then I think my daughter's gonna come back here and get a planner too I showed her this one um, but I think it would be better if she could come and just see everything and then pick out the one that she likes. I'm also eyeing this right here. It's a little, um, I think it's by Recollections. Yeah. And it is a goal, like a set goals kind of little planner. I can't even do this with one hand. But. That looks like that's really cool. 
um, but it's $19.99. I think that's a little pricey. I mean, even though it's 30% off, it'll be like 14 bucks, but I don't know. And they have all of those, which are gorgeous. Look at all those A5s. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to keep it simple today, and I think I'm just going to get these. Of course I say that, and I'm going to go look at stickers.